Our second book today is called Bats in the Band by Brian Lies. In hibernation, we rest asleep through icy months of storm, still, still huddled together and waiting for weather to warm. And every last one of us knows where to go, a summertime theater after a show. We're chasing each other. Come on, look alive. Nobody wants to be the last to arrive. But as we approach it, there aren't any lights. We can't be mistaken. We know it's tonight. We circle above, then a window's thrown wide. It lights up the lawn and it leads us inside. We swoop through the window, ignoring the bats, offering t-shirts, posters, and hats. A musical feast awaits us within. Why would we stop? We can't wait to begin. The space we fly into is warm and inviting. We set up the stages and fiddle with lighting. Some bats have instruments perfect in size, others without them. We'll just improvise. Behind the stage curtain, they're getting in tune, making up things out of straws, out of spoons. Other bad instruments came from afar, like curly horns, bagpipes, or dreamy sitar. And then when a bugle blast echoes once more, we stop what we're doing and flock to the floor. The conductor approaches, he lifts his baton, we all take a breath, and the concert is on. We sing together as one voice, it seems the very walls rejoice. All together, rafters ringing, it's as though our souls are singing. Then violins, viola, cello, change the mood to sweet and mellow. If you haven't seen a bat quartet, you really ain't seen nothing yet. The one bat band plays many things at once with the feet and breath and wings. And though we think this bat's inspired, watching leaves us, watching leaves us feeling tired. Next up, there's a country song. Some lonesome bat done someone wrong. He's gone and broken someone's heart. Now everything has come apart. In a corner tucked away and far away from where the others play, there's something for the younger set who can't sit through a concert yet. Over there, a singer cries of lonely days and empty skies. Her feelings fill the room with blue and soon we find we're crying too. It's hard to figure, eyes get wetter, so how is that we feel better? Now on the main stage, there's a hum of air guitar and blazing drums. Hearts are pumping, drums are thumping, everything that's loose is jumping. Can others hear us? We don't care, let our spirits fill the air. Everybody joins the beat, clapping wings and stomping feet. We bounce, we hop, we twirl, we groove, the music makes our bodies move. But daylight through the windows say it's time for us to go. So every bat who's willing crowds the stage to end our show. The music soars, finales here, the ending of the song. It builds and builds, now here it comes. It's going, going, gong. Then the shimmering vibrations dwindle down and fade away. And a silence fills our ears as loud as anything we played. A weary cheer, there's nothing more, but no one wants to leave. Our music was a gift we gave and one that we received. But finally we've got to go, we stretch and wave goodbye. Worn out, wrung out, half asleep, we greet the morning sky. Heading for home, we hum or sing and discover there's music on everything. The roar of a cat or the bark of a pup the sound of the rest of the world waking up. But our night is over. The summons of sleep is pulling us downward, drowsy and deep. And as we nod off, the last thing we hear is the sound of our hearts beating time in our ear. And though we stay silent all through the day, up in the rafters and sleeping, we sway. It's not our intention, but you understand we're dreaming of being the bats in the band.